Hey filmmaker Sean here, welcome to another quick DaVinci Resolve tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to do a JPEG damage transition. So we have here already two clips imported onto our timeline and we're going to cut these uh, yeah, begins just to make it less heavier for it to render. Uh, especially you don't want to drag in the effect onto the entire clip because you just want it to be at the part that it transition. So we're going to hold down shift and arrow to the left. We'll make a one second transition. So now command P to cut it. Do this the same at the other one. So hold down shift to the right and select this clip, command P and cut it. Now we're going to open effects inside of the effects library, open effects filters, and we're going to go for the JPEG damage. We can also click this search and type in JPEG and drag this onto both of these clips that we cut it. Make sure this is not double selected and both of them now have the effects and we are going to the first clip. We're going to the start or the begin of this clip. I'm going here on this to open effects and now we are going to change the quality to 20. Going to add a keyframe by clicking this diamond shape and also at the resolution one and the frequency scale. Now we're going to drag this to the middle and we're going to change this to one, this to five and frequency scale also to five. Now drag the, click the other one, this to one, this to five, and this to five also. I'm going to click these to add keyframes. Now go to the end. I want to move this to 20, this to one, and also this to one. So now we can play this and see the transition. So you can see it loses or becomes like really bad quality and then it changes to the other one. So it's like the JPEG damage transition. You can make it of course quicker by cutting less frames or using less frames or the keyframes. Or if you want it to be even slower, use more frames. So that was mainly it for the JPEG transition. Hope you guys find this video quite useful. If you are new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button here below and also make sure to hit that bell icon so you're always updated when I post a new video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys the next time. Bye bye.